eventually we'll have to go into David and then go into Delhi. We got a lot of fights on our hands still. Now religious unity would have been very nice. But then again we don't have it. Let's send you over there. Let's send you there. Merge up that army. Prepare for peace. Uh, we'll go to war against uh, the neighbor over here. We'll take as much as possible. While we hold. What's happening to... Uh, what happened to Min? Uh, Ming probably lost. Uh, let's take a look here. Who is the current controller? Yes. It, it, it's not Ming. It's the Manchu. Uh, the Manchu is the current. But he has no mandate. Whatever. So he probably just to, uh, took over. Uh, which is not a huge deal. Eventually they will be fighting... Uh, I think Russia. Yeah, there you go. The truce with Ming ended of ends in 91. So they took a rather large chunk out of them. Uh, I'm kind of hoping that perhaps... Look, the Commonwealth is my ally still. Can still grow him. Uh, supporting the independence of Maine's home and the Papal States. So he's currently a vassal under the Ansbach. Now that is not a huge problem. Because that is, I believe, a one province thing. Where the hell are you guys? Let's take a look. So that's him. It's not a one province. It's a four province. Highly developed. Cool. Uh, let's do a tiny bit of trade stuff over here. Um, are you part of the trade? Yes, you are. Let's get you. And not over here. We'll get that. Uh, this is not stated up by the looks of it. Oh yeah, we're just taking it. So that's probably not going to... We'll wait. We'll wait. Okay, let's group these guys up. We don't need you anymore over this region. Uh, let's send you back uh, for the next war. Uh, we got a good amount of heavies now, and I'm quite confident that we can actually keep going like this. We are still lacking a few uh, transports. Are we building transports manually by any chance? It doesn't appear to be so. Uh, which is actually quite okay. Let's go towards you. I want you to be 50 for now. 26 heavies. <laughs> oh yeah, that's nice. I like that. Uh, you, lad, you go over there because you don't get attrition in that region. Let's go and take this one. We're getting there. And we're not included subjects yet. Once this war is over, we'll make sure that... Um, yeah, the HRE is bloody messy. The HRE is uh, is also very annoying to deal with. I would really like to fight the HRE, in all honesty. This is a lot less strength than I thought it was, but uh, we'll see how far we can get. Also, temperatures are quite high now. Oh, sorry for the bomb there. I really, I do hope you forgive me. Oh, that would be hilarious if they come out. That would be a hell of a fight. Uh, do we have enough? No, we don't. Wow. Interesting. We can barrage them, but I'd rather not spend any of my points right now. Uh, we're making 90 still, so that's quite nice. Peace offer. Uh, we'll wait until that fort falls, mate. Uh, we'll 100% this. Uh, what we want from this war, let's take a look. So we want to border all of that. Are there some trade regions in this uh, area? Yes, there are. And we're going to be focusing on those. So let's pause it for a second. I uh, want this. Uh, we want Sayak. Uh, Palmsburg's already mine. Can we snake our way over to that region? Or shall we just say, you know, let's, uh, let's do it like this. We'll take the entire island over here. And keep Sayak. Claim Singapore. Eventually we will. I think this is more than enough for now. I don't think there is much else that we can get from this. 
Uh, Castile will be increased by 17. <sighs> Castile is never going to be pleased, man. Never. I'll take that. Uh, so there might be a coalition forming, which would be quite dramatic. Send you over that region. Let us score as much as possible. Overextension will go down. So right now, what I want to be doing is... Let's take a look over here. So Argentine could fight. Um, is Mexico done yet? Uh, by the looks of it, they, are, they took some gold, which is really nice. Let's see. We can go with Colombia. Let's go towards Colombia. Let's have Colombia fight a bit. Um, Colombia. Start colonial war and we'll go for English reconquest. I think this guy over here. Let's go there. Do it. Declared war on them. Uh, can we take crown land safely? Yes, we are able to. So right now influence is still at 70, which is a is annoying. That influence dies out really, really slowly. Uh, we got more separatists. So Bruneians. Yeah, okay, we'll deal with those. So, separatists in Brunei. That's this region, at least. Let us send you guys over there. Um, what is our current aggressive expansion? Okay, that's the revolt that we want to be crushing. Actually, with Pasai, it's a lot, but not so much in this region. Uh, it is a lot with Castile and Morocco, and it takes a bloody long time. Look at that, how long it's taken. So, maybe we should just walk Castile. And, let's see, what, what would it do? If we declared them, uh, Russia would go in, which is slightly problematic, but not as scary as I thought it would be. We do have 100k over here. And I would like to get the colonies. We got a lot of colonies that we need to do. But we're going to be um, expanding Catalonia. I want this guy strong. I need him strong. Uh, overextension is quite, quite harsh at the moment. But we're going to be going for this war. You go over there, mate. And you will head uh, not over there yet. Let's move over there. Cancel drilling. That would be, you know, wise. Uh, that would be a mistake. So, one. Uh, I think they're lost. They're lost. Also, I think it is time that we start adding a lot more heavies in these uh, armies. Like 20 of them. There you go. Should be enough. Yeah, I think they're gone. No, 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 no. What are you doing, dude? Keep the hell in that army. What the hell are you doing? Uh, we could keep them in, but uh, I kind of don't need to. Uh, enter the coalition. So, so we'll probably see more people joining in this fight. Let's see. There's 25 heavies over here. Send you into Kent, and you are into Kent, which is okay. We'll upgrade those uh, few ships that we do have. There's 23, and these are my heavies, so that should be... No, not big, a, a big deal. Let them join the coalition right now. We'll take some time. Let's get those heavies out as well. And that would be like 50 heavies in this region. Send you to Kent. And we'll start protecting trade over here. Uh, you, uh, what the hell do you think you're doing, mate? Okay, let's see if they will survive. 9th of April, self-sustaining colonies. We got a revolt in an area where we have some suppression of rebels. Yeah, okay, don't move him. He's going into port. We are lacking a general. Land Maidens, National Manpower Modifier would actually be quite nice. Um, it's Francine, so we're not using to promote that currently. 
innovativeness would go up. Uh, Gastony is just... How many provinces still? It's all course. Also, we need to state some areas up. Let's see, 9, 8, and 10. Let's take a look at this. So, currently, we are 9 years ahead of time before getting technology. And I think it is time that we get rid of... I think I, I will want to get rid of these free colonies and stuff like that. And we'll go for... I want admin. I want quality. But we'll start with admin first. And we'll build that up slowly. So, okay, what does this do? Because we'll probably will see less colonies. Actually, no. No, we're not. We still see the same bloody amount of colonies. Uh, we'll start building over here in Australia. There we go. Eventually, we will claim Singapore. Uh, we'll have a fight here with um, Castile. Now, Castile will, will take some time, but we want to take away the spice countries and also take this. That would be quite nice. How is this fight going, actually? So, he's still waiting. Um, can we send you over there? Uh, free policies. Oh, yeah, of course. Cause a conversion cost. I don't like that at all. Let's take the morale of army and recovery speed. And, yeah, this, this is kind of useless. I don't need that. So, we'll get some more military points now. Overextension will go away. Uh, we'll take things slow. My ships are about to hit this region. Let's group you up. And actually... I want you to protect trade. I don't fear the Russian Navy as much though. Because most of... Actually, there's 13 heavies of the Russian side. That's actually quite a bit. And let's just keep you out. And we'll give you the order to... Oh wow, we have a lot to upgrade. Uh, hunt enemy fleets in... I think this is the North Atlantic. Let's do that. Let's have some fun over there. Uh, can we send you to Toronto? Yes, we can. Let's go send you. Uh, military access. I will take that. Ten years of separatism? Oh, come on, dude. Just, just take that. Take that bloody fight. Uh, France has entered into the military coalition, so right now, just making sure that these guys on outraged countries will drag on the war a bit. If we can break the alliance with Russia, I'm quite happy about that. So right now, it does... Actually, Fran I'm worried about France. Come on, man. What the hell are you thinking? France is this tiny, tiny little, little contraption. It's one, two, three countries that are absolutely pissed. Timber boots four. I don't care about him. And yeah, that's four about him in total of the entire bloody world. So yeah, should we worry about it? Uh, no. Should we have him rule out these guys? Yes, we should. Suspicious indeed. 13 colonies gain liberty desire. As long as we don't see a message, we don't have to care about that. Let's keep that going up. How's my absolutism going, actually? Because we took some... Oh, damn you. Ah, seriously. The the 30% of the, the English monarchy is just so annoying. I can't change it anyways. Yeah, we'll probably have to go Republic. Let's go Republic. And... Uh, let's see. Uh, we're going to be keeping this guy. Republican tradition will go down due to it. Maybe that is not a wise idea. Uh, let's make sure we keep going on the admin. So we'll support him. Let's take a look here. What do we want? Noble elite. Uh, because right now my absolutism is 64. Which is a lot higher than it was. Uh, let's keep the game pause for now so I see if I really messed up. Um, let's go into this. Uh, no, maximum absolutism negative 40. Yeah, I don't think that's a wise idea. 
Uh, neither is this. Wow. So out of all of these options, the Noble Elites would just give me a negative 20. And this a negative 40. So we'll keep the Noble Elites. National Unrest. A random candidate bonus plus one. Yearly Republican Tradition. I'll go for the Republican Tradition. A yearly Corruption. A maximum Absolutism. There's the one that I want. Let's go with the Maximum Absolutism. Uh, state maintenance, uh, governing capacity, and uh, global trade, or expelling minorities. So the global trade, mm, how much is my governing capacity? So it's at 1430. I don't need it right now, but eventually we'll have to change it. How did the estates change? So we have the clerisy, the nobility... Uh, we did lose some lands here, uh, which is fine. We're not going to be changing this. We're just going to be taking away land and hoping that this influence will die out. That's, that's basically the gist of it. So once again, let's go back towards this. That's just not worth it. Governing capacity. Let's go for the global trade. Uh, we'll have to wait for the rest of it. Uh, what we want to do, institutional bracing cost. Uh, national unrest negative one i'll go for national unrest stability cost modifier or diplomat i'll go for the diplomat uh, at uh, administrative pos uh, possible policies or diplo possibilities uh, that comes down to this hmm. i think this would be quite a good the end to heresy act so we'll go for admin ideas instead of policies uh, instead of the diplo as for... Is it this one? Yeah. Uh, then tier 8. Manpower recovery speed. Morale of armies. I'll go for the morale of armies. Tier 9 is... Possible advisory cost. Minimum autonomy in territories. Uh, promoted cultures. I'm not sure about this one yet. Maybe the autonomy in territories. Negative 10. And then... This will bring me into the same bloody situation that we're now... But we're probably going to be reinforcing the Republican values. Administer free policies plus one we can take up to three. And the re-election cost is negative ten. So I quite like that right now. Uh, as for this... Yeah, it will be a bit low. But these guys can be absolutely amazing. Uh, this will change. This will change uh, eventually. <laughs> It was a 60 in there. But we'll, yeah, we'll have to deal with it. it. It's a sad, sad thing. Let's take a look if we can actually do... Yeah, we got some unrest everywhere. <clears throat> I don't want to deal with this. It just increases the autonomy. And uh, we cannot increase the autonomy. Or decrease the autonomy. Uh, I actually found that... States... Oh yeah, this is nice. So we can actually see where we can still build these, right? So, like, like over here. And in this region. And we'll go there. And now we don't even... This is such a handy um, menu, actually. Should have saw that a long time ago. So right now, we're fighting Castile. The colonies, they should be really doing a good job in there. Let's take a look. Oh, let's not zoom in until I break my face. I probably will need to make sure that we get... You know, we'll get him back. <clears throat> uh, let's go back to diplomacy. Uh, we'll just put on three on outraged. Because we need to make sure that we die out this... this uh, build up of coalitions because that's just too easy for them to make a trigger. Uh, we're currently making 36, which is not a whole bunch, but that will change. Look at that siege! What a joke! Uh, once that's done, we we'll go over there, and there we go. Separatist in Sulu. 
Uh, oh, that's annoying. Uh, we'll take that one first and then we'll drop on those guys. Actually, there is a war going on by the looks of it. You are fighting Psy. I'm kind of hoping you will. Yeah, you will win, of course. That's not a huge problem. Let's make sure you go there. Let's make sure. Okay, these guys are still sieging. There we go. And we'll drop you right on top of those separatists. Let's take a look. Okay, this one is done. Let's send you over there. How are my ships doing? Because I think my heavies are doing a wonderful, wonderful job keeping everyone in port. I love having so many heavies. Uh, we'll send you over there. Why did the lights join that? Oh, wait. That's now 28 heavies. There were some fights. Let's, uh, let's group you up. It's still 101... And eventually the Russians, they, they will come. Look, uh, Flanders is at the borders. Why are you there? And the Russians will most likely start hitting this region. Hmm. Uh, once the overextension goes away, it will be way easier to handle everything. Let's see, you can go to 55, you're on 75. It's just dragging me down, man. So, there is a Castilian army. There was a battle won, and it's probably the separatist in this region. So, once we take that... Oh yeah, this is great. I don't need to cut the uh, conversion cost, actually, so... Let's wait until these guys pop and then we'll send you back to Benai. Ah, uh, damn you. Losing stability like that is just painful. I like to see the admi the actually the Republican tradition grow like crazy. Um Let's take a look here. So eight years out of time. Let's get the glorious armies. And we'll re we will re-elect the, um, the fella. What the hell is this? Go send you down there. Go send you there. Start with the largest stack, though. So, we'll deal with that. Oh, look at that. The Castilians have made it. Two, tra two transports. Isn't that lovely? Okay, so he is moving those guys. Okay, so I don't like it when he's doing this. So he's just making them walk there. Well, he, if he goes in. If he goes in like that, they will just immediately. Are you kidding me? Okay, we'll go detach. And you go over there, boat bomb them. Uh, that we lost those uh, ships, I, I don't really care about that. Let's take a look how things are going over here. Okay, that's seized. It's down. Let's go down there. Yeah, he's seizing that down. Yeah, it's 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 not useful at all. Uh, we'll do have to bring some fights. So it's actually some troops over in this region. I would like to get the South Africans under control as well as some of these smaller territories in this region. Because then we'll bring him out of Africa. And we'll take away some of these um, islands as well as the colonies. And as for Russia. <clears throat> okay, so when we are done with Castile, why not bring our troops into Russia? And let's see if we can actually grab some territory over there. Uh, so we can start expanding into Russia. It will be dangerous because they have a crap ton of troops. We're losing a tiny bit of money. That's not a problem. That will all go away. There we go. We're making money again. So, in, instead of just keeping our guys over here, I want you to start protecting trade just in the English Channel. It's a relatively safe area right now. As for this region over here, let's go make sure we unoccupy all of this. Uh, those guys have been killed, which is okay. 
send you over there. Yeah, okay, that's nice. I don't mind if he fights that fleet. Because we have a shit ton of heavies in there. Looming disaster. So we need our stability at 3. Or have less absolutism than 50. So right now we are above 50. The stability needs to go to 3. We can't do that. Because it's really expensive. Because we lack republican tradition. What else? Robert, that's not at 50, you liar. It's at 51. Game's lying to me. I don't like that. I finally managed to get those heretics done. Okay, that's nice. Let's go take you before you take that uh, territory as well. I don't want that. You go there. And let's keep converting. Okay, let's get those troops over there. How is this going? So apparently there is a fight going on. So there are the Russians. Are there transports? There are 8 lights and 6 transports. So they won't be bringing in any troops like that right now. Uh, the Ottomans are still fighting Russia. So them fighting me and Russia is most likely not going to be ideal. And... By the looks of it, we've already taken some territory because Norway. Norway, you absolute monster. <laughs> you monster. Like it. So, we know there is still an army here somewhere. So, we'll kind of, I don't want to split too many. So, 12k. Uh, we'll have to keep a close eye on this. You go there. Uh, once this siege goes, we'll do it. Oh, there we go. There is that army. Okay, let's group them up, but we'll take the fight. I want to deal with his armies. Oh, you don't want this, mate. Uh, also, no leader. Let's go over there. Uh, we'll get a leader in this uh, army. And then we'll deal with his. So, it's moving south. Uh, we got the achievement down under. Nice. Oh, sweet. Oh, I like it. I like that a lot. Let's go move you downwards. Let's go take that fight. It's a three-star general, which is just absolutely lovely. Uh, by the looks of it, Russia lost the transport. Let's hunt those guys down. Eventually, they will run against uh, this army over there. Uh, this would be a ideal spot. We'll, uh, we'll, we'll lock him in. There's no way out for him. So, he... We'll go there. Yeah, I thought so. We need to wait until he's locked. Let's wait until he's locked. There you go. Now send him in. And we'll have a dry lens fight, so... Possibly no crossing or whatsoever. Are you bloody kidding me? Yeah, he is. He's definitely snaking. Okay, there's the fight that I want then. Is that actually going to be the fight? The fight of fights. Yes, it is. So, no crossing and the morale of him is just low. We go way. We d wow, we stack wiped that. <laughs> oh, yeah, I like that. I like that a lot. Okay, let's... Um, I'm quite confident in... Let's wait until we're there. Now we do need to deal with death. Five K. 